Hi, I'm Josh Dickey. I'm 27 years old and I've been training for five years. So this year in the jewels, um, set in stone to make them make the field so far is um, girls on film and CK Spur and Sartorius and if we can make a bit of money with Paramount King and All American um, they'll hopefully be in the field too. So the jewels means a lot to me, it's a pretty special day, um, it's arguably one of the biggest days in harness racing for New Zealand, a cup day is a big day but a card of nine group ones it's pretty special to be a part of and uh, it's just a great occasion for everyone. So I've been lucky enough to have trained and driven uh, four Group 1s in New Zealand and driven three in Australia and the beauty about them all, they're trained with my dad, John, um, it makes it even more special when you do it with family, but um, yeah, Speeding Spur has probably been a major player in that, that um, helped us win these Group 1s and um, probably so far the Great Southern Star was right up there, um, been Paramount King winning the jewels last year, that was, that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, that was a pretty cool day that I hadn't won a Jules before but Dad had trained a couple um, before that. Um, but yeah, that was a really special day. Of course that um, yeah, we had as a yearling right through and get him up to win the Jules, the two year old trotter, it was um, a very special moment. Yeah, to prepare for a big day like that, um, yeah, I suppose it's, it's just a normal day really, we've still got to get up and work a few horses or, or whatever, um, but you just try and keep relaxed as you can and, and um, as I say, you've got to treat it like another day um, and not let it get to you and or worry you sort of thing and, um, you know, just turn up to the track with a fresh mind and, and get into your work and try and get the job done. So Girls on Film, one of the horses we've got in the jewels. Um, yeah, she's done a great job for us this year. She ran second in the Trotting Oaks. Um, and they're great people to train for too as well. Um, Charlie Roberts and Paula Mary Kenny. Um, they've been good supporters of us and very loyal too and very supportive of any decision we've made with the horse and certainly made our job easier um, training this horse and through these major group ones that she's raced in and um, you know, and hopefully up to the jewels as well. All going well. But um, yeah, she's done a great job this year, and and I think um, you know if she's uh, on form on the day, she can be right there and hopefully get the job done. Uh, I don't tend to get nervous. Um, I guess you might get little butterflies sort of thing on the way to the races, but you know it's like playing footy and things like that. Once you get on the track, it's, it's all about doing the business, and you know you forget about anything you might be worrying about and you're just concentrating on getting the job done and um, you know so there's no sort of nerves getting in your way. Well, so one thing for the future, um, for driving anyway, I'd love to one day just tick off the thousand winners, um, that'd be pretty cool. And, a sort of fair way from it now but you know one day that'd be a cool thing to say that you've driven a thousand winners and you know, hopefully we can try and keep getting more group one winners and as the training side of it, it's about the same just keep training a lot of winners with dad and the more group one winners that come along um, you know we'll be wrapped for and the same thing hopefully we can train 500 winners one day and, and even a thousand that would be a, an ultimate goal but um, we'll just take it one win at a time and keep doing it with dad and you know Hopefully the future as well.